Today we're going to have a look at three string functions inside of MySQL. First one is concat, second one will be con concat uh, underscore ws, and the last one will be insert. Let's start with the concat. Select, we're going to select title from our books table, author, then comma, and now we're going to use our concat function, concat, obviously select should be with the t at the end as well. Uh, then we have title, then we want to concatenate it with space, by space, and then with the author name, so author. And we want to save it as uh, title author index. So next line will be from books table, and then we have order by our new field title author in the ascending order. Now if we run the statement you can see we've got the first uh, column as title, then we have author and then we have our uh, generated column title author. As you can see it's concatenated the title with the space by space and the name of the author. Some of these don't show properly here in this editor but if we click on this uh, you can see that it's actually on the on the second line that's why it doesn't show here on the line but it's still concatenating this correctly. So this is a concat function. Now if we use our contact ws, which is basically means with separator. So, uh, and for this function, first parameter is a separator, which we're going to be using, and we want to use space, and then simply the values which we want to concatenate. So we can remove these spaces from uh, our by uh, value here, and if we run it now, it gives us exactly the same results as you can see. The only difference is obviously we provide a separate as a first parameter. Uh, now, where you can use this basically, I most of the time use it for concatenating first and last names. So if I've got first and last name on the separate columns, within the separate columns, then I use this concat vs to concat concatenate as full name basic. So whenever I need full name, I don't have to concatenate it within PHP script. I can actually uh, use this full name uh, index created uh, within the statement. So that's uh, concat and co concat uh, ws. Now we're going to have a look at uh, the insert function. Now insert function is slightly different. Uh, it allows us to replace the string with a substring and what that means I'm just going to, I think it's best if I just show you. So if I use insert, it's not insert into, it's not an insert uh, statement, it's insert function just to, just to clarify. And we're going to use a title, then we're going to use uh, what uh, character we want to start replacing from. It's going to be first character of the title. And then for how many characters, let's say 10 characters, I want to replace these 10 characters of the title word with the, with the author, author name. So if we now uh, run this query, you can see we've got the uh, name of the author. Then it continues because the first uh, 10 characters is from still with the uh, uh, then we have the space, so we've got James Ball, which seem to be 10 characters, let's check, 6, 9, 10, which is replacing the first 10 characters. Then we have uh, uh, the title, which is uh, actually going right till the end of the title, but the first 10 characters has been replaced. Now if I change the first value and change the 10th, then if we run it, you can see that the beginning of the title, Composite, and then we have the name of the author, Excel and it's continuing after these uh, 10 replaced characters again. So this is how insert uh, function works inside of the MySQL.